So just a quick video to figure out which one of these fractions is larger, 3 eighths or 2 fifths. So we want to know if 3 over 8 is a bigger number than 2 over 5. There are a few ways to do this. This is one way I like to do it. What I need to do is I need to find a fraction that has the denominator down here the same for both of these. And when I do that, then I can just compare the numerator and see which fraction is bigger. You could list all of the factors, but the way I like to do it is, I see I have 8 here and 5 here. If I multiply this by 5 over 5, so it's the same thing, 5 over 5 is 1, but now I get 8 times 5 is 40, 3 times 5, that's 15. Down here, I'm going to multiply the 5 by 8, actually 8 over 8. That way I'm multiplying by 1, I'm not really changing the value. And 5 times 8, that's 40. So now we have the same denominator. 2 times 8 is 16. So we can just compare 16 and 15. We can see that 16, that's larger than 15. So 2 fifths, that's larger than 3 eighths. So that's a good way to do it, rather than listing all the factors, especially when you get bigger numbers here with lots of factors. You can just multiply the 8 by 5, and then the 5 by 8, and that'll get you your common denominator. If you divided 3 by 8 on a calculator, you'd get 0 0.375. If you divided 2 by 5, you would get 0 0.4. You could consider that 0, 0 after there. Same thing. And you can see again that 2 fifths is larger than 3 eighths. This is Dr. B, comparing 3 eighths and 2 fifths. Thanks for watching.